What's up guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to fix the error of missing DLC in Assetto Corsa and Content Manager. So this file collider is missing from the DLC packs. So uh, you will see how to fix this in the video and I'll show you exactly what to do. So you guys can see here I don't have the DLC in my uh, actual Assetto Corsa. Uh, I don't have any of these DLCs, I just have the base game. And this is the reason why you get this error, especially if you're trying to join DLC servers like Nohezi or others, this will fail. So um, let me show you an example. So if you go here, you have this Nohezi server and this BMW over here, the M2 competition, actually requires the Porsche DLC. And some other cars also require it. So, for example, if you try to select this one, the M3 F80 also requires the Porsche DLC. So, once you start loading the game, uh, it will start loading and then it will give you the error that I showed you initially. So, it will tell you something about this Collider file, Collider.kn5. And this is the file you will need to replace, okay? So, you see here, the location is actually content slash cars slash no hazy bmw m3 f80 so you need to take note of this location okay you want to click no so you don't need to run any validation just ignore the error uh, you need to take note of the location of the car okay so content cars no hazy bmw m3 so just be aware what is the car model that you'll need to fix so this is the first way to fix this is going one by one, you know, fixing the cars that require the DLC. So you want to go to the Steam, manage, and then go to um, browse the game location, go to content cars, and then inside this content cars folder, you will need to find the car that was broken. So the car that has the file that doesn't work. Uh, so in this case, we were trying to go for the Nohezi server, so we're looking for the Nohezi BMW M3. This is it. And you see this is the Collider file that has an issue. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually rename this file to something that I can save it as a backup. So something like Collider Backup. Okay. To make it easier, you guys can go here in the view and show file name extensions. So this will help you guys figure out what what is the file this is the file extension dot kn5 and you want to go now to the pagani huaria and you want to copy the collider kn5 from this car the pagani huaria and you want to copy it over to the bmw car that we just saw and want to paste it over here so now you have the backup file and you have the new one which is a copy from the pagani so now if you join you will see that it will eventually load, but now a different car just popped up. So you see here, now it's the Porsche GT3 RS, which is missing the file. So basically, this means that you will need to do this for every car that has the DLC. So you can just copy over the collider.kn5 file to the folder and create a backup. So do the same thing for this car and repeat the process okay so you can do this until you have all of the cars that require the file uh, patched and then it will just load into the server okay so let me just show you here i had the collider file copied over and now um, i will be able to join the server eventually right so you see here i just loaded in there were no issues because this file will not affect anything about the car. It's just like some collision stuff. So eventually, it's eventually the same thing, right? You don't need to really worry about it uh, because it's just the way it works. So you can actually test what it looks like. But yeah, this will allow you guys to load into the server, okay? And this is precisely uh, what we want to achieve. And you guys can see here that I can use all of the options that I want. So I can open up the chat, I can teleport and so on. So right now what I've done is I'll show you the second method. So there's a second method to do this with a script. 
if you guys are interested this is way easier so you want to follow this link over here and you want to download this file ac unlocker so this is something created by the community this is uh open source so you can check the source of it it does not contain virus and anything like that you can check the creator it's a uh, known creator so yeah i will show you exactly what it'll do so just download this file to your Assetto Corsa folder. Now you want to open up the file. You can actually just run anyway. Uh, it will give you a warning, but it's just because it doesn't know the author. And right here, you can put the file path of your Assetto Corsa content folder. So it should be the default one, which is on top. And if you press enter, it will just patch all of the cars in your game, okay? So basically, what this is doing is it is patching all of these cars that have the Collider KN5 file to have the same file that doesn't require the DLC, okay? And this is actually going to allow you to just patch it once and that's it. So every time you will need to download additional cars, you need to do this again, okay? So, for example, if you now join a different NoHazy server that has different cars, you will need to run either run this patch or do the process that I showed initially, like copying the file manually. Um, so this is the way to fix it if you guys don't have the Assetto Corsa with the DLCs. And this actually works really well because it's just about this file. Nothing else changes in the game. It's the same car the same acceleration, the same statistics. So you won't be punished by that, right? It's just something that was kind of blocking some error and now you just fixed it by replacing this file, okay? So it will not give you any advantage whatsoever because this is not considered like cheating or whatever because it's exactly the same car you're gonna be using, okay? So you guys see here that I actually loaded into Assetto Corsa and I, I'm actually able to see the Noezy server and play around with it. So hopefully this will help you guys to fix the problem. If you have any questions, just drop a comment below and I'll gladly help you. So this is it for this video and I'm out. Peace. That is it for this video, guys. I hope you have enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to drop a like on the video and also consider subscribing with the bell notifications on so you don't miss out any of my future videos. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace!